A new beauty trend that has everyone talking is freckling. Mm. It's an hour-long procedure in which freckles are tattooed onto your face. Oh, dang. Here's the thing, though. It could last for up to three years. So, ladies, would you ever try this new beauty procedure? It can last for three years. Hell no. We were just talking about this when it came to makeup. The center of your face is so important to have that globe, that, yeah. that, that strobe, you know, it, right here. So when you model it with things, what if it turns out wrong? What if as skin ages, the, the dots start to mold together? Oh, I like gosh. that it's not so... So, who, who wants you know, to look like Pippi Longstocking? That's, That's what I, was what I don't say. I do love freckles, okay. though. I do, I do love that. Have... It reminds me of five-year-olds. But it's so cute. Remember when Tamia came out with her video, So Into You, and she had that splash of freckles across her nose? I loved it right but there. But I think mm. natural freckles are pretty, not like the ones that they tattoo. That's, that's yeah. me because it looks kind of, my personal opinion, it just doesn't look real to me. Like Lonnie was saying, you know when you have a doll and you see that they put freckles on yes. their face? That's what it looks like to me. Yeah, that's what I, it, doesn't it hurt on your face, a tattoo? I'm sure it's a tattoo. It probably feels just like a yeah. tattoo, just on your face. Ugh. My thing is, it's so funny to me how the beauty industry has literally convinced us that the grass is always greener on the other side. Yeah. My sister and I recently went to, like, it's always, yeah. exactly, yes, I'm that, okay. <laughs> because my sister has super thick hair when I tell you, like, low-key abnormally thick hair, like uh -huh. her, her ponytails are like this. Oh, so And stunning, so she goes to the hair salons and they're like, oh, we need to use shears to thin out your hair. No. And then I would, I would say that I have like a normal amount of hair. Yeah. They'll be like, okay, we're gonna put four packs of hair in your head. And I try to listen to that. I'm like, that's literally, you're telling the person that has thick hair, we're gonna make yours thin. And you're telling the person that has thin hair, we're gonna add three packs of fake hair into yours to give her what you just took away from her. Right. right. It's literally the opposite. If you're dark skin, they're like, we got BB cream to lighten your skin. If you're right. light skin, go get a spray tan. Right. It's yeah. like you, you can never, if you, you have never freckles, win. you're trying to find a way to get rid of your yes. freckles. If you don't have freckles, let's tattoo them on your face. I, when are we gonna be happy with just what we have? Just yeah. Owning what you have naturally. Oh, right. Enjoy that. Yeah. I agree don't with you the... notice that? So, no, don't, don't you notice that people with curly hair want straight hair? People, people with straight hair want curly hair. hair. People but with light you... hair want dark, dark hair. People yeah. with dark hair want light hair. <laughs> what if you do like the look of that innocence that freckles can give you sometimes? Like right now, you're sporting a super sultry, smoky eye. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That suits a look. You want to have a little bit of a bedroom look, you know? I like freckles giving you that innocent sunburst look. So with something like this, like I actually did a tutorial where you can do it with a pen. Yeah. And all you have to do, see what I mean? It's just like a Too Faced pen. Just give yourself a little couple of sprinkles, and it gives you this really innocent finish. They actually That's have a cute. new way, Jeannie, where what? you take I a like brush. Thank you. <laughs> it's it's actually, you can YouTube this. There's this really other cool way that you can do it that's not permanent. You literally can wash your face and take it off. And it's actually with a speckle brush. So you take a yes. brush oh, and, yeah, and you, you dip it and you just go yeah. like that yes. and all the little spots come on your face and it looks really I don't natural. mind, yeah. you know, I, I, I'm just worried about the permanent stuff. Yes. I don't mind like stuff like that that's, you know, temporary. Yeah. It's the permanent stuff yeah. that people yes. do that I think, you know, because you can always change wigs and yes. things like that. Yeah. And it's you know, to experiment. Yeah. yeah. Now yeah, now. but I, like I don't know about me. It's, I'm too dark for freckles, so oh. it's just... Wait, you know that's actually not true. Like, people think that people that are brown skin don't have yes. freckles. That is not true. But I'm saying, if I put... I naturally put freckles... On, if we tried to do that, I would look crazy. No, it, you it, wouldn't. It, it would look like acne marks. No, no. it would look yes, innocent. It would. Freckles immediately give a look of innocence, just like lashes give them... We gonna a, try. A, Am I the only appeal. one that naturally here has freckles? I you have freckles. freckles. She has uh -huh. freckles. I honestly, you guys, didn't even notice I had yeah. freckles until I got social media because then people were complimenting me on my freckles. Thank you. That's but gorgeous. yeah, I didn't even think it was a thing. Yeah. It was now I have moles. I yeah, have moles too, yeah. up here. Where's Where, somewhere? Do you? It's a beauty mark. Yeah. Oh, you they should always cover it up That's with makeup. That's pretty, Lonnie. I always oh, say if the mole, if the mole is pretty, thing, you can call if it if the mole is gross and it has hair, call it a mole. But if it's pretty, call it a beauty mark. <laughs> but, I like that. There is one beauty thing that I, till this day, from year 1998 till now 2017, that I think needs to be tapped out because I never think it looks real. What? what? <laughs> Colored contacts. Come on oh. now. Come on now. Do people still when you're, wear they do. contacts. They do. When so, you're talking and you're blinking and you're rolling your eyes and you're, your contact is chilling right there where your pupil's over there, come on now. <laughs> That doesn't Wait, look cute. I'm not trying to be funny. Do people still wear colored contacts? I don't know. I've seen it. Kanye wears I've seen them. it. 
Yeah, it's a lot of people. Yeah, but that's wear. like more that's so for fashion. Like arts that's and fashion. Yeah. We're talking about people that are actually trying to convince you that their eye color is a different color than Tell brown. It. It's still, I mean, they still selling them. I'm telling you. So somebody Some wearing them. Some people permanently they... change their eye color. You can do that oh, now. Yes. Like tiny. Yeah, yeah tiny. Yeah, it was pretty. pretty. Permanently changed I hers do like that. to, like, I think it was blue. Like a violet. A gray blue. It actually, you guys, in person, it, it looks beautiful. It looks it's real. Gorgeous. It is. Yeah. Yeah, but then there's this Asian girl that lives down the block from my house, and she put on straight periwinkle blue eyes. Our <laughs> people don't come like that. <laughs> don't fake it. If well, they're mixed, they, I've seen it. If they're mixed, you show me that Asian person with the blue eye. I will. They're mixed, so they're kind of okay, like, yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're mixed, a little white in them. Okay. Yeah. But it's all That's trends, Jeannie, yeah. and nothing's wrong with trends. Yes, That's all yes. it is, okay? <laughs> okay. It's trends. Make sure it looks a little natural. Okay.